today I'm going to show you how you can run a POA miner for PRCI coin. POA stands for Proof of Audit and it's a chain auditing system that PRCI coin is using. So every step what I'm going to explain is also in the description of this YouTube video and I, I will also put a link in the description to the knowledge base so you can also read it in the knowledge base first we are going to the PRCI coin website and then we are going to the section of the knowledge base Yes, we're going to the section of the knowledge base. And then we are going to the section Master Notice and POA. And there you have the knowledge base article of how to set up a POA miner. First, we're going to download the Power Miner files. We're going to the GitHub, and there we need to download two files. The Power Miner is made for the Mac, for Windows, and for Linux. So I'm going to show you how you can set up a Power Miner on Windows. So we need to download the Power Miner Win64.zip and the JSON configuration file. We can close that window. Uh, we're going to extract all the, the POA minor file. And we are going to put the JSON file in the same directory as the POA minor file. And now we're going to open the JSON file. In this file there are a few important uh, parameters. The first one is on this sentence is uh, you, need, you need to choose a username and password. I leave it uh, as default so I choose username and password. Uh, I think it's better if you are going to mine choose your own username and password. The second important uh, parameter is how many threads are you going to use for POA mining. That depends on how many cores your, uh, your system has. Um, I will choose two because I am at a virtual machine and I have two cores, virtual processors in it. So I'm going to close that file. Uh, what I'm also going to do, I'm going to create a batch file so that I can so that I'm going to click on that file to, if I want to start the, the POA miner, I'm going to call it run.cmd. And in that file, there is the, the POA miner.exe. And here you have the config file so that the miner knows which configuration it needs to load. So I'm going to save that. And now I'm going to the directory where the wallet config, where we can find the wallet config. The default location of the wallet config is in app data. And then in the PRCI coin directory, here you have the PRCI coin.config. We're going to open it. And there we're going to put three parameters. The first one is server is one. Be that's needed so that the, the um, POA miner can connect. And the second and the third one is the RPC user and the RPC password. So that are the, uh, you need to use the same username and password in this configuration file as in the JSON file, uh, which we opened uh, 
earlier in this video. So we can close this. Now we are going to open the wallet. Because if you want to run the POA miner, you need to you need a running wallet and a wallet that is fully synced. Otherwise you can't otherwise you can't um, run the power miner. So every hour the power miner uh, every hour there is a POA there was one successful power mine. The more CPU power the more CPU power you have the more chance you are yeah, going to win the, the power mine. Now I'm going to double click the run dot the CMD file. And now you see he's, uh, he's mining successful. Um, you can see that on this sentence that the mine is not successful, but that means that the power miner is running, uh, running well. So if you have a successful mine, you don't see that mine, you don't, you, you see something like, uh, yes, the mine is successful and you see a yeah a sentence behind it. So this is it. Very easy, very simple. Happy mining and I hope you will be very lucky to mine a lot of PRCI coin. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment if you like this video and if you like also share. Thank you. Bye bye.